with Thanksgiving around the corner and the holidays not too far away. November and December will give you plenty of opportunities to practice your French over a delicious meal. You've already mastered bon appétit and santé. Let's take a look at some other useful expressions. To set the table is mettre la table or mettre le couvert. For instance, you could say Tu m'aides à mettre le couvert? Tu m'aides à mettre le couvert? Which means, can you help me set the table? When you're ready to eat, you can say À table! À table! And that means lunch or dinner is served. To toast or to drink to something is trinquer à. For instance, you could say Trinquons à ta promotion. Trinquons à ta promotion. Which means cheers to your promotion. To say have another helping of or a glass of something, you can use reprendre. Vous reprendrez bien un peu de dinde? Vous reprendrez bien un peu de dinde? Which means, would you like some more turkey? If you do, say oui, volontiers. Oui, volontiers. Which means, yes, please. Literally, yes, gladly. But if you don't, you can say, non merci, j'ai plus faim. Non merci, j'ai plus faim. Which literally means, no, thank you, I'm not hungry anymore. Now watch out. Don't say, I'm full, je suis plein, or je suis pleine, as it doesn't translate. If you are full, but can't resist having some more, you could say, d'accord, mais vraiment par gourmandise. D'accord, mais vraiment par gourmandise. La gourmandise is a deadly sin. It's gluttony. But it's also the love of good food. Another common way to say have seconds is se resservir. For instance, you could say C'était tellement bon que je me suis resservi. C'était tellement bon que je me suis resservi. Which means it was so good, I had seconds. Finally, Leftovers are les restes. For instance, you could say J'ai beaucoup trop cuisiné. On aura des restes pour demain. J'ai beaucoup trop cuisiné. On aura des restes pour demain. I cooked way too much. We'll have leftovers for tomorrow. Try practicing these with your French friends and stay tuned for more French language tips.